I was helping my 12-year-old granddaughter to prepare for an audition for the school Christmas show. She knew that perhaps she may not get through because usually all the older children uh, got the main parts and, and the younger ones did all the backup kind of routines. But she wanted to give it a go, but she was so nervous and afraid that she might fail. That was the biggest worry, that she might fail and that people might think she didn't try and uh, didn't want to let her parents and her grandparents down and things like that that kids at that age tend to worry about. So we worked through the short sketch and the how to, to dramatise it and put the energy into it and the accent that she needed to in the right places and all those kind of things. And then I listened to her sing three musical pieces, which were just beautiful. She sang them so, so well. Voice of an Angel was Grandad's comments. And afterwards, she felt confident and proud and willing to give it a go and not too worried. Her dad came in at the end of it and she wanted to perform everything that she'd learned with her dad. Dad was over the moon and said, Dad is amazing. But she was so different after one hour of a little bit of coaching than she was before she went in. She went to school and she performed her best. She actually made a mistake, but it didn't bother her. She just did her best and came out feeling confident, knowing that she had done her best. I had spent time encouraging her, telling her that everybody gets nervous. We all will fail from time to time, but she can go and do her best and possibly she could really get through. But she didn't, as always, next year. And what she needed was that someone to believe in her. And that made all the difference. And I believe that that is what is needed. I have four beautiful grandchildren. And for me, the best gift that I can give to every one of them is to help them believe in themselves. I do that by me believing in them first and genuinely believing. It's all right to say, oh, it'll be all right and all of that kind of thing. They need genuine help and they need to know that somebody believes in them and they begin to believe in themselves. Think about it. Is it not the same at work with some of our young people, our new starters, any person struggling in the job? but certainly some of the younger people who've just left school and in, into a new job. So easy to knock them, but what they really need is help and guidance and support. Someone to believe in them. Be that mentor in the workplace if you can. It means taking a little bit of time out. It means stopping and thinking before we speak to them and say something that might actually unintentionally put them down a little, but rather to say, well, why did you do that? Let me show you. Be a mentor to young people. I'm a passionate believer in the potential of people. So go for it with your young people in your organisation. I'm a believer. Are you? <laughs>